Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I got a new laptop. I'm just gonna unbox it in front of you. It's the new 2020 MacBook Air. I got it specced up to the top. So I basically just, you know. Basically, I bought a MacBook Air. It wasn't the base spec, so it wasn't the thousand pound one, the 999 one. It was, it was like, basically I just got, I basically clipped all of the extras that you could have got. I like the packaging on this. It's like proper secure and everything. Yeah, obviously here it is. Obviously I chose gold, didn't it? I don't like the space grey one, that one's just boring. Obviously here it is. I chose the gold, in my opinion. It just looks better. And yeah, silver is just boring. I've obviously got a silver Dell laptop and that one was just boring, so I got this one. One thing I love about the Apple products, they got tabs in all their packaging. Uh, I don't know, it's just quite cool. It's just quite satisfying. It's like kind of therapeutic as well. Ew, that's sick. Oh, is that it? Yeah, this is what I was saying about my iPhone. Like, when you guys open your Easter eggs, do you like keep the thing whole? Because I like to keep the whole thing as a unit. Like, I, I, like obviously, I've seen people just like rip this whole thing off. But I want to see if I can bring it off without ripping. Ooh. Without ripping it. And then I'll just put it back in. Because I love keeping the boxes, so all of my iPhones I've got, so from 5 upwards, so I've got the 5, 6, 7, I've got the boxes for all of them. And the SE actually, yeah, I got the SE like ages ago, not the SE, 2021, I can't bother to get that one. But like the other um, SE, the first SE that come out, I got that, and I kept the box for that. So I basically got all the boxes for all the stuff I got. Okay, that come off in one piece, that's what I said, I like that. So here is the MacBook. So the specification on this is the 13 inch. This is like the top of the range one. So there was there's eight core CPU and then seven core GPU for the graphics. This is eight core for both, eight core graphics and eight core CPU processor. Stop it. Hey, that does sick. So yeah, here's the box, just empty inside. This feels so cool. Look how thin it is as well. The screen is like way so thin. Pretty that, like look at that. That is thin. That's the screen, the top bit. And literally the back, I reckon is only big because the ports, otherwise, it doesn't even need to be that thick. Because obviously the front of it, it is like a wedge in it. So like, it's, th it's thinner there and it's fatter up here. But yeah, that's cool. So yeah, in the box, we got the Type-C to Type-C charger. So that's the charger I got in here. And then in here is like a leaflet of all the information and whatnot. So that's what I've got inside the box. Oh my god. Oh, this might not even be what I wanted. I literally bought the Thingy Bob for one reason and it's not even got it. I wanted it to have the full size enter button. You know where it covers two rows? Oh wow. That's like the lit only reason I bought this laptop. That's why I didn't get the Pro. Because it showed that it's got this. My other laptop, I got things on it at the moment so I can't show you. So I basically got my... The whole thing up here but basically i got like a whole enter button so it goes all the way out and the modern ones is just one row across but anyway all right cool so that's that and yeah so we got that information thingy and it's got a couple of books in there it's got some stickers as well and it's got like proper gold ones as well to go with the color of the phone oh sorry the laptop and then it comes with a plug as well and that's it really that's all that's in the box This just looks cool, you know. I have even got all of this for my, um, you know, the this stuff. I don't know what it's called. I got it for my iPad as well. Everything. I keep all the packaging. So yeah. Look how thin it is. That's like amazing. I don't even know how to describe it. The mirror shine on it's got the mirror the apple mirror that's sick all right cool so the finger test wait it opens yo look watch this so like look with one finger i'm not going to support it or anything but like watch this and it comes on if that doesn't amaze you i don't know what will because that literally with one finger just pulled it up and it didn't even move like the base was solid. Oh no, no, it's got it, it's got it. See, this is what I was saying. This is the only reason I bought this laptop. So the enter button, I prefer it when it's like a whole unit, like the whole button. You know, modern laptops only got it on the one thing. 
on the one row. Um, to use English as the main language, press why is the return key. English, enter. Yeah, this is sick. But that's what I was saying, like, you know, the enter key is like a whole full button. On modern laptops, it's not. This is tiny, though. I thought it was going to be bigger, but it's tiny. The press trackpad is amazing. Oh, my God. It is learn next how to level. Use to set up your Mac. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm not used to it. I'm not going to be used to this because my other laptop, my Dell one, and my work one as well, they were both touchscreen. This isn't going to be touchscreen, so this is going to be totally different. <laughs> For my Mac machine, do you want to transfer your information? For my Mac time machine, what's a time machine? Bro, <laughs> nah, not now, we don't want to do no time machine. Oh my god, this has got the stupid keyboard. So everything is going to be different. So like the speech marks thing in my bobbies are different. So you have like the speeches here in it, like the, I don't know what they're called, but you've got the at there and the speeches is here, that's where the at should be. I don't even like this already. I don't know, that's just annoyed me now. The keyboard's meant to be normal and I was expecting it to have different controls in it. Like the control, option, command and all that. I've seen all of that. At, oh, okay, there's a key. I like the keyboard though. The travel's good. The key, the keys are good as well. Right, has anyone ever like have you, has anyone ever read the terms and conditions for anything? Oh, cool. It's a lot smaller than I wanted. Maybe I should have just gone for the pro. Oh yeah, I got an idea. If you're watching whilst this is setting up, go down to the comments and let me know some. if you've got a MacBook or something. Give me some tips and tricks and stuff that you reckon I should do or I should know. Because I've never used Mac before, so like, it'd be good to know like, if there's anything cool. If there's some tips, tips and tricks. Continue. Yeah, I don't need none of that. And yeah, so here we are. I don't have a clue what any of this is. It's totally different to anything I've I'm normally used to. I mean, setting up took not too long. What happens if you close it? It's still on. Look, like, this is what I was saying. With one finger, without it losing its thing, it opens. That's cool. I got some cases for it to match my phone, but it wasn't the right colour, so I got a closer green. But listen to this, I took this out of the packet already. Does that sound sick? <laughs> I don't know if you're supposed to do this. But yeah, that's the glass screen protector for it. So yeah, I got a glass screen protector for it. I've never installed any of these before. Okay, cool. So basically, I've not had no luck putting the trackpad protector on. It just makes it worse and it's not comfortable to use. It makes your finger skip. It's not smooth anymore. So I just got rid of that. Another thing, I put the screen protector on, but it left so many nasty marks on it. Um, so maybe it just needs cleaning. I'm not sure. I might take the screen protector off as well. Not worth it. But yeah, all in all, I'm happy with it. Look how thin it is. I'm just amazed by that. That's sick. But yeah. I mean, the gold looks a li little bit pinky. Um, it almost looks like a rose gold finish. So I don't really like that. But otherwise, it's exactly what I wanted. I like these keys. That's the best thing. That's another reason I bought it. Because so, they're not pear-shaped keys. So it's not like the different sizes. I'll show you an example. Um, but yeah, I like these keys. That's another reason. And the enter button. That's the, probably the only thing that made me buy this. But yeah, that was basically the unboxing. And if you've got any tips and tricks, it would be appreciated if you could let me know. But yeah, thank you for watching. I'll link my Instagram in the description below. Again, like I said, I'm not sure what's happening with my custard donuts one. That one's just broken or something. I don't know. Check out my other one, fmod.postman. That's my, like, my personal one. Um, so yeah, follow that. Um, subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Drop a comment down below, just anything, tips and tricks, I don't know, you, whether or not you enjoyed the video, how I can improve my videos, what you want to see on the channel and whatnot, but yeah, cool, yeah.
I don't know, what should I do on this? I don't know what to do, like, is there any more videos you want to see on this? Like, I've got some accessories coming as well, so i got some cases and, um, I don't know, I could do, like, a comparison with something. I don't know, is there anything you even want to see this again? <laughs> I don't know, whatever, in it. Just let me know, just, just drop a comment, press the like button, thanks for watching, and boom.